Hi everyone, today I have got a bit of a fitness haul for you and okay, the reason I'm doing this is I usually buy myself clothes for the gym when I'm rewarding myself for doing really well and going to the gym really regularly and being really healthy and that hasn't been happening lately. I've been eating out a lot, um, which is not good for me at least. I was like, it's okay, I'll just go to the gym more. No. I don't know what is wrong with me but I do not want to go to the gym, I cannot motivate myself, I don't know what the hell is wrong with me, I really don't know. So this is my thinking, if I buy myself some nice new sort of cute gym clothes, maybe I'll want to go more. I don't know, maybe I'm doing this the wrong way around but just being completely honest with you guys. Does anybody else have any tips for motivating yourself to go to the gym? I've tried everything. I've tried looking at people on Tumblr and Pinterest and you know Instagram and like oh damn look at her abs and then I'm like oh, okay I'll just curl up. I think it's because it's so cold here. Everybody in London is like wearing their summer dresses and if it was warm I would probably want to go to the gym more because I'd be like shit I'm gonna bare my body soon but it's really cold and I just want to get into a blanket so I'm going to promise myself that I'm going to make this video, edit it, upload it and then I'm going to go to the gym and I'll put my Instagram below and please go check my Instagram, I will do a check in after my workout. You need to hold me to this, seriously, because I, we need to work together, this is not easy. Okay so I'm actually going to show you the clothes now, um, they're all from Primark because I wanted some workout stuff, I wanted to keep it budget friendly and I thought I would test out the Primark workout stuff and let you guys know what I thought about it. The first thing that I got is a pair of trousers and I got a size 12 because that's what I usually am on the bottom and these are kind of stretchy workout pants so they have a drawstring inside here at the front. They're three quarter length trousers and I have some similar to this from um, Under Armour which I love and they're compression pants so they're really tight, they really stay up when you're running on the treadmill. Um, what I like about these is that they've got a zip at the back on the waistband or just underneath the waistband so you can put you know, your key if you go running and you don't want to take a whole bunch of stuff with you or your gym membership card and yeah, I just thought I would give them a go and let you know how well they stay up. They've got this kind of detailing on the bottom bit. These were £7, so really inexpensive and they're that kind of shiny material, stretchy material that I really like. I tend to find that if I wear leggings or uh, something that's kind of cotton, they go really baggy and they fall down and they kind of stretch, so I thought this stretchy material was the best bet. So I got that. And everything else I got are sort of tops and gym bras because I wanted to have some kind of nice coloured tops to wear underneath other things at the gym. So the first thing I got was a basic black sports bra because I wanted to try this out. I have quite a large chest, not huge boobs, but I have significant chest situation going on and if you are blessed in the chest department shall we say, you'll know that it's sometimes painful to run on a treadmill if you don't have correct support bra and things like that on. So I do have a really really good sports bra. I would recommend Shock Absorber for those of you who are in a similar situation to me because literally they don't move and um, I wear that when I'm going to be on the treadmill or doing anything that's high impact. But I do like trying out inexpensive options, especially for days when I know I'm going to be doing either weights, uh, strength training, or if I want to do something like yoga and pilates where I want to keep everything in place but I don't necessarily need the support as much and that means you can have that one in the wash and things like that. So I thought I would try this one. Um, it's quite a supportive material at the front and then it's got this shape which is perfect for supporting everything. This is like the best kind of um, back to have if you want a lot of support, a racer back. And the front is actually quite supportive and I got this in a medium because I do like my sports bras to be quite tight and to hold everything in place. So I'll let you know what I think of that and again it's the same kind of shiny stretchy material with some mesh at the back and that one was £4. So if I don't love it, I'll just use it for yoga or something like that and it's not broken the bank. So I got that and I got the exact same thing in this neon pink. It's very coral in person but it's looking extremely pink on camera, um, especially next to this um, cardigan that I've got on. But it's the exact same thing, same material, just a different colour and they have little hearts here as well and that one was £4 too. 
and then I spotted these more stretchy tops these are something that I would wear over the top of a sports bra so I wouldn't wear these alone just because they're nowhere near as much support as I need they are really really stretchy so they're not gonna hold you in as much but definitely for Pilates or yoga or something like that you could wear these and these are bigger as well they're more like a crop top type gym top than a sports bra so you could wear these over your sports bra or you could wear them alone if you don't need that much support but these are really really cute peeking through sort of you know drop sleeve tops and things like that I just think it's really nice and I know some people think you don't have to get dressed up to go to the gym and you don't but it's nice if you feel nice and it motivates you you see these nice bright colours um, I got this in a 10 to 12 I think this is quite big for a 10 to 12 because it stretches so much um, so I'll let you know how that goes but this was £4 as well and then I got the same thing in this neon yellow it's got a bit of a green tinge to it but it's yellow top as well and again 10 to 12 and I got that in a 10 to 12 and it's four pounds and yeah I think these are really cute and then I got a top which is more of a loose top and I really hope that they make these in different colours because I would love a black one and a grey one and I'd love lots of different ones of these because I think it's really really nice but it's basically this baggy top which has this cut out detail at the back and it's really loose really loose top but it has fitted sleeves so you can see that these are you know they're going to be tighter on your arms and then this is just so loose and the sides have this see-through mesh sort of you know the swept proof like mesh things at the side and I just thought this was really really nice it was five pounds and it says that it's peach but it's quite pinky but I just think this is such a lovely top and I think I'm going to wear this today with the um, black pants and one of the sports bras to test it out and I'll let you know what I think in an upcoming video Maybe I'll do a favourite gym wear type video and show you my favourite things to wear and my favourite brands and I'll give you an update on these. But yeah, I just thought I would share these with you today. I need to go this afternoon because I've been putting it off for so long and the thing is, when you get back into it, you feel amazing and you're like, yeah, I want to go every day, but it's that initial push and the reason I got out of going to the gym is because my car broke. Um, I was without a car for two months and you have to get the bus and walk and then it's I know that's so lazy because I could have gone but I didn't I used it as an excuse not to go we've all been there and now I have a new car but I'm like oh I'm always finding a reason not to go this afternoon it's happening have cute clothes to wear so thanks for watching this video I will have some more recipe videos coming up for you and if you have any requests then let me know. I will speak to you very very soon and um, yeah check my Instagram, leave comments encouraging me to go to the gym because I really need you to push me. Come on, motivate me. I need it. Okay, I'll speak to you guys soon.